Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at a Springfield Armory XDM 5.25. It's a full size handgun. It's a, known as a race gun. You know, with the five and a quarter inch barrel. I love full size handguns. The accuracy it delivers and the confidence that it builds is excellent. And it's just so much fun at the range. You know, if you can't shoot well with a full size handgun, then probably in need of a training class. But this one here is the 9mm. It does come with three magazines that carry 19 rounds. I already mentioned five and a quarter inch barrel and a trigger pull right around five and a quarter, maybe five and a half, somewhere between those. All right, it does have an ambidextrous magazine release, adjustable rear sight, black serrated with a fiber optic front sight, and lightning cut in the slide okay that offsets some of the four end weight with the longer five and a quarter inch barrel does have a pick rail there a couple additional back straps to customize the shooter's hand size and the loaded chamber indicator bar and the striker fire indicator right there but i have to tell you this gun has been around a long time and now it's only available with their elite line and this is part of their Elite line. Now this is a 4.5, XDM Elite 4.5. And some of the changes they made, I think you will find advantageous. Let's start with the slide serrations. A little bit wider cut in both front and rear serrations with the Elite model. If we look at the grip safety, we'll see that's a little more 1911-ish. Comes out a little more as where this is a little more flat. We will notice that it has a flared out magwell. All right, so this will come with that. Whoop, mag's already out. A little more traditional right here. This will come with the flared out magwell. And I mentioned ambidextrous magazine release, but this also has a slide stop that's ambidextrous. All right, as where this one does not. But the greatest advantage that I see is the trigger. They shortened up the reset. It's a flat trigger. Also has a trigger bar safety in there. And then the reset is right there. Opposed to, remember I said it was about halfway to full position. That's not. That's a lot shorter reset. So this is the 4.5 model. All right. The 5.25 model will have those additional features. If you go with this and it'll be called the elite now it will also have magazines that carry 22 rounds the base plate goes down probably about that much further but let's compare this with a couple other handguns here we have the walther q5 match all right running out of camera space these large guns here and we'll take a look at these two fine handguns that's not lined up there it is all right a little bit longer with the xdm and then the grip length a little bit longer with the XDM as well. This is carrying 15 rounds. This is carrying 19 in its current form. Here's a Ruger American competition. A little bit a little more uh, heavy here. All right. And over here we can see I'll go this way this time. All about the same slide length. And the grip length, a little bit longer with the XDM. This is carrying 19. This is carrying 17. So it aligns well with other handguns, okay? A little better capacity. But we'll go ahead and show the internals. We'll lock the slide back, move that lever up, drop the slide off of the frame, polymer frame, all right? We knew that. And then an uncaptured recoil spring all steel guide rod and over here is five and a quarter inch match grade barrel look at that i love full-size handguns i know i've said it already but i continue to say that whether it's a 1911 or something like this it is really nice because sometimes i do i get this a little better working working it with my thumb there it is all right, and so it's uh, extremely accurate and a pleasure to shoot. Let's go ahead and get it on the scale, then we'll wrap this thing up. 
the unloaded weight is right here one pound twelve and three eighths ounces we move that to just ounces 28 and a quarter all right that's the same and then over here we've got 19 rounds of target loads the loaded weight 36 and 3 8 ounces so about 36 and a half ounces now a lot of full-size handgun owners they don't worry too much about the weight but if you're a competitor you might you might worry not worry but you may be concerned with the weight because you're you're running around you're you're firing you're reloading you're doing all that stuff and the elite model would be a, a nice choice with this especially with those quick mag loads with the flared out magwell but there it is all right it does come with additional posts well, i guess i'll show that in the case three three magazines additional uh, fiber optic posts there you can go with the yellow you can go with the orange i love fiber optic front sights really aligns well with that black serrated rear okay pick up that picture nice and bright at the range but there it is xdm 5.25 it's available in their elite line and i really like the elite line i think they made some great changes if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate the thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe